OK, in this section we're going to be looking at proof. And we are going to be working our way through these different topics. OK, so we're going to start off by looking at consequence and equivalence. So we're going to be looking at uh, arrows, effectively, how we get from one thing to another. Does one thing imply another? and vice versa, okay? So that is what we're talking about with consequence and equivalence. Uh, proof by exhaustion is a type of proving um, a statement by trying all of the different possibilities, okay? So we're going to work through some examples of that. We've got proof by deduction, so that is going through a logical proof, constructing a logical argument. It may be algebraic. Uh, but it doesn't necessarily, it doesn't have to be. We're going to look at some examples where we're going to have statements um, where we have to disprove them uh, by finding a single counter example. Okay? It's only one, it only takes that one uh, example that doesn't work for um, the deck of cards, uh, the house of cards to really fall down. Okay? So these first four parts. Uh, are all a part of the AS uh, for um, AS in maths, whereas uh, the only section uh, that is just in the full A level and is not part of AS maths is proof by contradiction. So proof by contradiction will be looking at um, looking at a statement and then assuming the opposite show that that must be false, and so the original assumption must have been false, and so we can prove uh, the statement that way. Okay, so as I said, these first four sections are a part of AS Maths. Um, all five are part of the full A-level.